<clears throat> okay hello guys this is uh, the example 2 the phase 2 of my project so I have here I have here my my drone that is transmitting their GPS position and height extracted from the, from the Pixhawk to the uh, Raspberry Pi with Python with drone kit and sending it by a transceptor built in Arduino and a, a module in radio frequency to 2.4 gigahertz frequency that we can, and we can uh, change it to 950 megahertz but now it's not 2.4 gigahertz sending it the uh, its coordinates and height to a receiver a drone receiver I don't have yet my drone receiver uh, built but I have the brain I have the, the Raspberry Pi that is going to acquire the information and okay you can see the here that the Raspberry Pi is getting the uh, GPS position and height of the other drone transmitter drone and also I am simulating the GPS position uh, and a uh, height of the of this drone the, of this receiver drone that I will be building by tomorrow and I will be attached this and then this is receiving and uh, simultaneously is transmitting this is like a relay transmitting and receiving via this uh, again this transceptor with Arduino and a 2.4 uh, gigahertz transceptor um, this is sending it this is sending so the both GPS coordinates of the, trans the transmitter and this receiver to a base station <clears throat> that I made here that is receiving it via this transceptor again Arduino and 2.4 gigahertz uh, receiver and I made some uh, interface uh, that is receiving um, from Python, the coordinates, then from Python I will pass the coordinates from the serial port to uh, G JavaScript and I create this interface made in HTML5. So it's real time. Uh, the, what we have here is I am calculating the distance between the two drones with the GPS position and the height, the 3D distance, I mean between the, the both UAV, both drones and alerting me if a distance, a threshold distance is um, is uh, overpassed so uh, with this I can make a lot of things I can put, uh, I don't know, a button, I can put uh, I can process this data, I can extract more data from the drones and process it here and, and uh, presented in real time so this is what I've done tomorrow we'll be flying it to test it bye